Swayam Prabha Digital India Educated India Welcome to the lecture on characterization of flow. So, uh, we talked about uh, the stimulus response techniques uh, uh, in that we talked about the uh, pulse input and step input. So, uh, just having an overview of that. So, as we see that if you go for the uh, step input then we get the uh, F curve and uh, the F curve is nothing but the uh, concentration time curve that is obtained at the outlet stream plotted on a dimensionless scale. So, then, then it is known as the F curve. So, you have uh, on the y axis you have dimensionless uh, uh, concentration and on the x axis you have dimensionless time. So, in the case of F curve uh, what we uh, how, how we go with it is that uh, at a given time t equal to 0 we are starting the adding of the tracer into the inlet stream uh, at a rate that is maintained constant throughout the experiment. So, uh, you have the tandis and you, uh, you are giving that uh, uh, you know um, uh, tracer into the uh, tandis uh, constantly uh, at a constant uh, you know um, uh, rate. So, that way uh, uh, and uh, its uh, um, concentration at the outlet will be um, uh, uh, you know uh, monitored. So, at the same time we uh, sample the exit stream continuously and plot the exit concentration of tracer as a function of time. So, we uh, allow the tracer to go into it, it will uh, go inside the tundis and it will flow as per the path which is available to it depending upon the uh, you know configurations inside the vessel and then it will coming out. And then at there uh, we have the instrument by which we measure the uh, concentration uh, of the tracer at the uh, outlet of the uh, tundis. So, this way the curve which we get that is known as the F curve and a typical F curve uh, you know for the plug and mixing flow uh, will be uh, like this. So, that we will uh, talk about uh, uh, what is that uh, plug and mixing flow. But then uh, you can see that uh, your uh, you know once you look at the uh, uh, F curve, so this is uh, this is where uh, you know uh, from here the concentration starts appearing at the exit. So up to this much of time, uh, there is no uh, tracer concentration uh, being appeared at the you know. Uh, uh, turn this outlet. So, the, uh, the, the tracer which has gone inside the tundis, uh, it has come all through uh, without uh, you know uh, going to the outlet and then after that the, the part has started appearing uh, at the outlet. So, it will start appearing and then slowly it will go on increasing. So, you have a plug component, you have a mixed component. So, then mixing uh, taking place and uh, then uh, this this curve is uh, so this is your uh, dimensionless concentration and uh, basically if you look at uh, so this is one so if you go for larger value so it will go and touch uh, nearly one uh, so that will be uh, you know uh, that will be the um, f curve now use of the step tracer input may not be practical because of extensive uh, contamination of the product and the uh, cost of tracer so it's not uh, very much uh, you know uh, in practice except uh, you know we can certainly go for the numerical analysis of these processes where we don't require these expensive uh, tracers uh, and its use uh, but uh, you know you uh, do not prefer that because uh, uh, if the tracer uh, you know is going continuously into the molten steel 
uh, you know, uh, so that may even contaminate the steam. So, you may like to have the uh, concentration analysis at the uh, exit, but then uh, uh, you have uh, uh, you know uh, that will uh, certainly contaminate the whole steel. So, that is one issue. Another issue is that uh, since you are continuously supplying, so it also adds to the cost factor. So, the cost of uh, tracer will be another burden. So, because of that you try not to uh, uh, use it practically, uh, you better go for the other kind of analysis like uh, C curve or uh, pulse input. So, uh, we have already studied that in the C curve your injection of tracer is made as a short pulse and uh, resulting dimensionless, uh, uh, so that results into dimensionless concentration and uh, uh, time curve at the outer stream and uh, the, the curve which you plot uh, for the dimensionless concentration and the dimensionless time that is C curve and uh, it will rise to some value and then drop again to 0 uh, when the entire tracer has exited the vessel. So, we already had discussed about it. Now, this is how the uh, C curve looks like for the plug and mist flow. So, you now what happens that uh, this is uh, you know uh, it uh, starts appearing from here and uh, then it has uh, uh, reached to a peak value and then further it has started decreasing and if you increase this dimensionless time you know axis uh, to larger value slowly it will be coming towards uh, approaching towards 0. So, this is uh, basically the uh, the C curve. Now, uh, you know that we had already seen in our earlier lecture. Now, the thing is that when we talk about these uh, flow systems, so if you talk about the continuous flow system, so they can be classified by the uh, type of flow they are exhibiting. So, you have two extreme cases uh, of uh, possible fluid flow and these two extreme cases are like uh, you have plug flow and you have well mixed flow. So, they are uh, normally considered as the uh, ideal flow. So, uh, you know uh, in actual case uh, you will have uh, certainly uh, variation from these limiting or ideal cases and uh, there, will, there will be non ideal cases because uh, uh, in actual these, uh, these, these uh, plug flow that is your ideal plug flow or ideal mixed flow that does not exist. Uh, but uh, so you will have the uh, non ideal uh, flows uh, they are uh, normally you know uh, present uh, which is uh, uh, practically seen inside the uh, tundis. Now, coming to the uh, discussion about the uh, plug flow. So, plug flow is uh, so in this type of limiting type of ideal flow system the longitudinal missing is uh, non existent. So, what you see that normally uh, you know we, we define as the metal which is uh, the tracer which has gone. So, the plug flow means uh, the longitudinal mixing will be non existent. So, long the mixing in the longitudinal direction that is that is uh, not at all there. So, it will have it will be maintaining uh, its identity and it will uh, flow in, uh, uh, in on its path there may be some amount of uh, uh, transverse mixing uh, to certain extent you know uh, in the in that case uh, in the case of plug flow. So, the necessary and uh, sufficient condition for the uh, plug flow system is that uh, all fluid element have identical residence time in the vessel. So, what we see that uh, normally uh, you have uh, all the fluid element which is there. So, it will go and it will exit the vessel at a time which will be same as the uh, mean residence time inside the uh, vessel. So, everybody has every fluid element which has which is flowing uh, in that plug manner. So, it will have the same you know uh, mean residence time. So, what you see here is that uh, uh, the flow is uh, going and it will come and then it will be out. So, this is the example of the uh, uh, plug flow. 
So, uh, if you talk about a uh, plug flow system and if you talk about the C curve. So, in the C curve how can you uh, schematically uh, represent? So, what you see in the C curve uh, what you have seen that in the C curve what you do is you give the short pulse of tracer it will go into the uh, tundis and then it will come it will uh, go inside the tundis at a different location and then it will come through the uh, outlet. Now, in the case of ideal plug flow system if you talk about the uh, C curve what you see is that the tracer which you have added uh, the all the fluid element will be uh, spending a time that is equal to theta equal to 1. So, theta equal to 1 means it is the mean residence time actual theoretical mean residence time. So, at the theoretical mean residence time all the tracer has come out. So, you, you see a long peak and then here itself it vanishes. So, all the uh, you know tracer has come out of the uh, Tundis outlet at this time that is the time of actual uh, you know I mean theoretical mean residence time. So, this is known as the ideal plug flow the, the tracer which has uh, you know entered. So, into the vessel and it has come and slowly it has gone and it has come out of the uh, outlet. So, it has spent the ideal time. So, it has not interacted with uh, you know uh, with other fluids. So, either in longitudinal or in transverse manner ideally and uh, then it has come out and it will be or wherever it has gone it is basically volume by volumetric flow rate that is your uh, theoretical mean residence time. So, it has gone out it has not uh, it has maintained its identity and then it has come out without mixing. So, that is your uh, you know plug flow in the case of uh, the uh, pulse input system. Now, if you talk about the uh, step input system so that uh, f curve for f curve if you see uh, the, the plug flow will be represented by this curve. So, where it tells that the metal I mean the tracer which has gone into the metal. So, this tracer has uh, not uh, you know interacted uh, anywhere and then when uh, it has spent uh, a time of uh, the theoretical mean residence time inside the vessel that is Tundis, then all the tracer has started exiting. So, basically tracer has been uh, is continuously being put in and all the tracer uh, is, is, is flowing. So, and then uh, it, it will stay you know together in the uh, Tundis for the theoretical mean residence time period and then after that they will start exiting. So, once they start exiting then their uh, concentration will go on increasing. So, I mean not increasing basically it has directly reached. So, it is they are all coming out. So, the concentration is uh, dimensionless concentration is 1 itself. So, this is the you know uh, uh, representation for the uh, plug flow either be it uh, when you uh, talk it uh, in terms of the uh, C curve or you talk in terms of the uh, F curve. So, you can represent these uh, you know uh, plug flow on these two systems like uh, these two curves. Now, uh, next will be uh, your uh, mixed flow. So, the mixed flow will be uh, the type of ideal flow that will be representing the uh, other extreme of the uh, mixing that is uh, you know the maximum possible uh, mixing of the fluid uh, you know uh, inside the vessel. So, uh, if you talk about uh, the uh, mixed flow. So, uh, in, a, in that case what you uh, assume is that in the, in the plug flow they are maintaining its identity whereas, in the mixed flow it is assumed that once the tracer has gone inside the uh, vessel it has completely mixed inside. So, uh, you know uh, so it is like a uh, system like uh, you know uh, once you have any system. So, uh, if you have uh, you, you just have an impeller and uh, 
you know uh, and then you are uh, rotating it. So, uh, you know all these things will be moving like uh, you know everywhere. So, this will be completely uh, mixing into it. So, this way you will have a completely uh, mixed flow. So, you have sometimes something flow in and then if you have some flow out. So, uh, so that way you will have complete mixing if you have a mixer with a stirrer or so. So, this is the example of a uh, completely uh, you know uh, mixed flow. Now, uh, what we uh, know by this uh, you know if you try, try to analyze uh, these uh, uh, mixed flow systems. So, if you uh, see the you know uh, considering consider the mass balance of tracer in the system where you have put the uh, you know tracer into the uh, system. So, in that case uh, you can write that rate of tracer input. Uh, minus rate of tracer output that will be nothing but the rate of uh, tracer accumulation. So, um, uh, what you write is that uh, you can have uh, the uh, q 0 minus q c. So, that will be uh, d by d x of v c that is accumulation and uh, accordingly. So, you can uh, from here uh, what you can uh, see that if you write this uh, you know q uh, 0 minus q c. So, that will be you know q c it will be uh, the accumulation. So, d by d t of v c. So, uh, what you from here you get uh, d c upon c. So, that will be uh, you know minus of q by v and uh, that will be d t. So, this is q c. So, d c uh, you know uh, this side it will have d c upon c. So, this will go and minus q by v and then that, that dt will go this side. So, uh, you can uh, integrate it and uh, you can integrate it uh, you know uh, uh, by having a, a certain boundary condition. So, if you integrate uh, suppose and uh, if you are giving the boundary condition like uh, you have uh, uh, you know you, you take c as q by v. So, um, uh, so, you so you would have uh, um, c equal to q by v at uh, t equal to 0 and then you have uh, c equal to c at uh, uh, t equal to t. So, this uh, being the boundary condition you can uh, uh, you know so for t you have taken the two time and, and, and what will be the concentration. So, based on that uh, you can uh, uh, further integrate. So, uh, d c upon c so it will be log c and for the different uh, values you will have a log c upon uh, you know q by v. So, that will be uh, equal to uh, you know uh, minus q by v into d t. So, uh, so that will be uh, you know so in, in this case uh, you will have uh, uh, so this is uh, log c. So, that will be uh, minus theta. So, you will have if you look at this c value it will be e raised to the power minus theta. So, that way uh, you get uh, you know this uh, curve this RTD curve for the uh, well mixed flow if you take the uh, completely mixed flow ideally mixed flow. So, it will have the concentration it will uh, go like uh, that. And if you take theta as 0, so initially at time 0 you will have concentration as 1 and as you move uh, with time. So, you will have the uh, you know uh, uh, if, you, if you try to plot. So, uh, your uh, plot will be so you, you what you see is this is an uh, exponential decay type of curve is uh, being seen. So, you will have uh, uh, this way uh, your uh, so, this is being c and this is being theta. So, in the case of well mixed flow uh, ideally mixed flow your c will be uh, e raised to the power minus theta. So, uh, this be being 1 and your theta is uh, you know uh, increasing. So, this will be 1 this will be 1.5 and then in this way it will be increasing. So, this will be 0 0.5. So, uh, you will have 0 and 0 values on uh, the sides. So, uh, this uh, uh, curve this shows the uh, C curve for the uh, uh, well mixed flow uh, you know uh, in the case of uh, uh, you know when we talk about analyzing uh, the uh, C curve. 
Now, if you uh, try to uh, go for analyzing the uh, f curve, so suppose we are uh, talking about the step input. So, uh, you have seen that in the case of a step input uh, uh, for the plug flow it has uh, there is nothing uh, till t equal to theta equal to 1 and then your uh, concentration value is uh, dimensionless concentration value is 1 uh, altogether. Whereas, if you uh, talk about the step input case uh, you know for the uh, well mixed flow. Now, in that case uh, you know again uh, you can have the analysis like you have the uh, rate of uh, tracer input and uh, minus rate of tracer output. So, that will be uh, rate of tracer accumulation. So, uh, this is uh, normally uh, what is we have seen also in the case of uh, uh, you know uh, uh, the uh, pulse input also where uh, we found the uh, well mixed flow uh, uh, expression. So, uh, the here also this is conservation uh, principle. So, this is rate of tracer input minus rate of tracer output that will be rate of uh, tracer accumulation. Now, in this case what will be happening you will have uh, q c i minus q c. So, that will be d by d t of uh, v c. So, that is uh, uh, your uh, you know uh, that is a conservation principle this will lead to uh, this uh, uh, value. Now, uh, what we get we get the, uh, the parameter d theta. So, uh, this d theta uh, will be uh, nothing but it will be uh, you know d f upon 1 minus f. So, uh, if you uh, try to you know integrate uh, you know for these uh, cases. So, you will have the uh, boundary conditions. So, um, if you apply the uh, boundary condition you know in, in, in these cases. So, um, uh, boundary condition will be that you will have f equal to 0 uh, at theta equal to 0. So, at, uh, at uh, you know time of 0 your f becomes 0 obviously, then uh, your uh, f becomes uh, f at uh, theta equal to theta. So, uh, if you uh, try to have the uh, you know uh, uh, the integration. So, what you see is you uh, you get the integration by integration you get f equal to uh, you know 1 minus e raise to the power minus theta. So, uh, so th this uh, uh, curve which you get that will be uh, you know giving you the uh, f curve for the uh, well mixed flow. So, if you uh, draw the uh, well mixed flow uh, you know uh, curve. So, that curve will be uh, looking 1 minus e raise to power minus theta. So, it is uh, uh, nothing but 1 minus that. So, this will be exponential curve. So, you will have uh, if you draw the uh, f curve for the uh, well mixed flow. So, you will have f here and this is your theta. So, it goes like uh, this. So, uh, certainly this will be approaching to uh, here it will be 1 and this will be 0.5. Similarly, uh, you will have uh, 0.5, 1, 1.5, like that. It will be uh, moving. So uh, this uh, RTD curve uh, that will be, uh, you know, uh, that will be given by uh, this uh, expression. It will be represented by uh, this line. So uh, the thing is that. Uh, uh, now, what you see from uh, this curve and the uh, f curve which you have seen uh, for the plug flow. Now, in the case of plug flow what you see is that there is no increase in this stressor concentration uh, till uh, this point and then here directly you have this value coming horizontal value coming. So, uh, what you see is that uh, in, in the idealized plug flow you will have simply at, at this point theta is uh, equal to 1. Uh, so, here you will have uh, increase. Now, in this case uh, you are seeing that it is in the well mixed flow it is simply increasing from here. So, the thing is that as soon as it has entered the tracer has entered 
it has uh, started uh, mixing with the uh, flow. So, it is uh, idealized mixing and that is why the pattern is uh, like this. Now, what happens in actual case if you talk about the uh, actual case, the actual F curve will uh, move like this. So, uh, you know as you see that this, uh, this part is basically the the reason which is uh, talking about the, the plug flow conditions and uh, then uh, you know you have the, the then the mixing has started. So, ideally your uh, mixing has so if you had it been uh, 1 here the theta have had it been this theta as 1 here. So, ideally the, the it has to start from here, but the in actual case uh, there is no flow which is ideally uh, plug flow or ideally the mixed flow. So, the so this part will be represented by the plug region and uh, uh, accordingly we will also uh, you know study that uh, you will have the plug volume uh, also will be uh, you know a component inside the, uh, the vessel. So, you will have this plug component and then you will have the uh, you know mixed component. So, if, so the you have plug flow and uh, mixed flow. Now, the thing is that uh, when you have the uh, plug zone and also you have the mixed zone, then what are the other zones inside the uh, tundis. So, uh, as we have discussed as we see that when we talk about these uh, uh, curves, so it will be 2 and then we go to 2.5 or so. Now, if you talk about the uh, normal RTD curves uh, you know uh, inside uh, uh, the uh, tundis. Uh, or, or in any system. So, what we see uh, that uh, you know uh, when we talk about the uh, uh, you know um, the C curves where you have C and this is your theta. So, what you see that this is going and uh, may you may go uh, you know uh, to a very large time. So, till that time that tracer is somewhat coming out or so. It means that some part uh, you know uh, it is taking very this is staying very long time inside the tundis. So, uh, you know we have to have certain reason where if the metal goes from there while coming uh, you know it, it takes a long time to come out of it. So, apart from this uh, uh, plug flow and uh, so plug flow we will uh, talk about the plug uh, volume and mixed flow will be representing uh, later on uh, we will be studying that will be talking about the mixed uh, you know volume inside the tundis. Apart from that uh, you will have another zone that will be dead zone. So, that zone so normally in the vessel we try to have uh, three uh, kind of zones. So, you will have uh, plug zone you have uh, mixed zone. And then apart from that, so this is, so in plug it is not able, it has not uh, you know mixed, it is uh, has maintained its identity, so it has not mixed uh, longitudinally or so. Now in mixed zone means it has completely mixed, but then uh, there are certain uh, zone which has, uh, which is staying for very long time. So, so that is basically representative of certain zones inside the tundis where if the metal gets trapped or the tracer getting trapped it will uh, be having very uh, you know large time retaining inside and it will be coming after a very long time. So, that is uh, basically uh, the dead regions uh, you know uh, they are represented by the dead regions inside the tundis and in that case uh, you will have uh, the calculation of the plug volume you have calculation of mixed volume and the rest volume. So, uh, that will be dead volume and that will be uh, basically uh, you know we will be calculating it. So, you have the, the way to calculate and uh, there are different ways to calculate and different uh, you know uh, theta is also considered for that. So, you may uh, define that those particles which are taking uh, you know more than twice the mean resistance time that you may uh, bring into that category or sometimes maybe three times. Uh, you know uh, staying more than the theoretical mean resistance time that may fall into that category of the uh, you know dead region. So, accordingly we try to you know uh, 
you know uh, define the different uh, you know uh, type of uh, um, volume zones inside the tundis uh, based on uh, you know uh, these analysis so you will have we will have we discussed about uh, you know these uh, uh, you know uh, plug and the uh, mixed uh, you know uh, uh, flow which is happening inside the uh, tundis so uh, what uh, is meant to be said that uh, the two these two uh, you know uh, extremes that is ideal uh, idealized plug flow or idealized mixed flow they are the two extremes but the actual flow uh, will be staying uh, in between these two kind of flows and uh, you know uh, so the, the actual flow needs also to be uh, characterized and for that uh, you have the uh, different uh, kind of models are developed uh, to characterize basically uh, the, the, the actual uh, flow conditions, actual uh, uh, flow which is uh, uh, you know uh, occurring inside the tundis which will be the uh, combination of the plug as well as the uh, mixed flow. So, you, you have uh, the uh, plug component as well as the mixed component and based on that uh, you know uh, we further uh, we try to uh, analyze these uh, reactor or the uh, vessel uh, you know uh, I mean, and judge its effectiveness uh, how well it is going to uh, you know uh, be used or, or to respond to the uh, metallurgy uh, as a metallurgical reactor or uh, uh, as a batch reactor or a batch vessel when we are using it in the continuous casting tundi. So, that we are going to study in our uh, coming lectures. Thank you very much.